Hey guys, what is going on? It's your boy Anna from Anna Gaming, and we are going to be opening up some Japanese Pokemon cards because I couldn't get my hands on Miracle Twin. So, or not Miracle Twin, uh, Shining Fates. Aha! I couldn't get my hands on Shining Fates, um, so we're opening up the Japanese Alt Mir Miracle Twin uh, for you guys today. And without further ado, roll the intro. Thank you for joining us today on the Anog Gaming channel. Please remember to drop a like, hit subscribe, hit that bell for notifications, and if you are interested in any merchandise, or as you young kids call it, merch, please click the link below, it would make me so happy. Now, on with the video. Thank you, again. Alright, alright, alright. You're good to go. Alrighty. Okay, I like how the Japanese do this. There's like two little doorways. Now, this is not me, this is Nick. <laughs> He's taking half, and uh, I'll be taking half. Here, I'm going to drop my cam for a second. All right, you're good. You can keep going. Well, I've gotten a couple hollows so far. Alright. Couple hollows. I see. Yeah, can I just last my salad? That's all we have so far. Alright. <clears throat> whatever that is. Tanyano. You know more about the Pokemon names than I do, yeah, even though I've also been playing Pokemon for a long time. And uh, whatever that? that one is, that's a Misty of Yeah, some that's some a Misty of some kind. I saw something. Maybe you're blind. <laughs> oh, I guess I'll just hope and... Hey, this plus... Actually, I'm not, I'm not gonna curse this by saying it can't possibly be worse than a maximum goal, but uh, that was a disaster. I mean... Technically, if we make no money on this set, we still made more back than we did on maximum gold. Because maximum gold, we spent like $40 more than we did on this. Also, I should mention, maximum gold is a generally worthless set. It is, unless you're a collector, then... It's still worthless value-wise. I'm surprised this set doesn't have any code cards. I think that'd be a thing. Yeah, we got ourselves a, uh, Hollow and a Chrozma. Oh, it froze. You mean, or it's like slow. Give me two seconds here. What's happening? Uh, just, just, just the epic, just this artwork just, you know, broke it. That's how cool it was. <laughs> yes. We got ourselves a Sableye. Alright, yeah, it's good now. Epic. I don't know what happened, okay? <laughs> Too much movement. <laughs> Seriously, 
this is like, what's up with these guys? Such a pain in the open. To open. They're Japanese. They're not, they're not expecting how to walk. They have tentacles to open them. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Yep. Hello. Uh, we have, uh... That's a waifu. I see a waifu. I think that's green. I have no clue. But, uh, yeah, we have a holographic trainer card of some of somebody. Don't know. Don't care. I'm not going to have the price guide up for this, because, honestly, most of the price guides are annoying to read. Because you can't get these on TCG Player, because they're TCG, so there's no these price are, guide. These are OCG cards? Yeah, these are OCG. So you can't get them on TCG Player, so that means that there's no... Ooh. Oh, wait, is that a GX I see back there? Well, potentially. Oh. Got a little slip. Oh, this card's uh, warped. <gasps> yeah, we got That's. I think that one's one of the money cards. Yeah, we got an Aerodactyl GX and then a uh, this. Let's go quickly sleep this bad boy up. I believe that one's one of the money cards here. I'll actually try to see if I can find a price guide. And in the meantime, uh. In the meantime, we'll continue our little opening. Honestly, that's a pretty epic artwork, not gonna lie. Wait, yo, I even pulled the actual card I need to play this thing. If this was TCG, then I could. Huh? I, I actually pulled the false of this needs, I think. Oh yeah, that's right. For some reason, my Wi-Fi doesn't let me go to, like... ...weird places. <laughs> okay, I'm an absolute mess of this, but whatever. Alright, um... Arrow... Okay, PSA is not a good place for it. It's gonna be um, Aerodactyl GX for the um, you know whatever the set is number forty-five yeah. out of ninety-four. Yeah, I'm trying to find a heckin' price guide for um, Jack price guide price. that's not like weird. Um. All right, here I'll just look it up the old-fashioned way. Aerodactyl GX. Um, Miracle Twins forty-five. What is the Japanese rate for that? Let's see. Huh. How much is it? Eh, like one and a half bucks. According to this website, but this these are Japanese prices. So... If you sold them here in America, you'd probably make a lot more. We'll double check here, though. Oh, great. You know what? Who cares if we make our money back or not? We can Google that later. Oh. I swear, if I don't pull anything good, I'm blaming you because of the shuffling that I did. <laughs> Has nothing to do with you, but I'll blame you for the shuffling that I did. Yeah. <clears throat> there we go. That right up. That's a nice little, that's honestly, it's cool looking. Yeah. I don't know if that could actually does it. It's a tag team. I don't know. This is a tag team, or both of these boxes that I bought are tag team. Yeah, um, I saw that on the packs and stuff. I don't know what tag teams are. Uh, they're... They're basically a souped up GX, mostly. I did see, like, are they the ones with two Pokemon on them? Yeah. Because this set has a Rainbow Mew and Mewtwo. Tag Team GX or whatever. Uh, yeah, it also has a Psyduck and Slowpoke. Or Slowbro. Oh, no, I missed it. Attack. Is it that, that very very disappointing pack? <laughs> Watch you pull the two best packs in the set. Or in the box. I mean, you're not, these aren't necessary. Like, I, don't, I don't remember the general ratios for these packs, but I know there's not a pack thing now. Some, sometimes you get lucky, sometimes you just get screwed. I know with Pokemon, you can get the occasional god pack when it comes to the Japanese, where they're like all like foil crazy cards. Granted, that's like a one in a million. Yeah. Okay, that's a pretty dope of annoying Bernard if I do say so myself, honestly. Yeah. Too bad we can't play any of these. 
Yeah. Oh well. I mean, you can't play any of them anyway because they're not standard anymore. Because these were from 2019, so I believe they've already rotated out. Uh, yeah. Probably. This is just for the collecting bit. <laughs> do not like to open. No. They do not. Unlike the American pants in which you can just rip open nice and easy. You always see something shiny back there, but I don't think it's anything fancy. I don't know, it's purple. Could be a Mewtwo. Nope, it's just a Galissapod. Oh, I was seeing the purple uh, Jinx. Ah. Uh, I will give this set though something. I will give this set something. It has pretty good cool artworks overall. And we are on yeah. the last two packs. This half of the, uh, for for your half, yeah. Yeah. Hmm. Gotta love to hear that creaking plastic. Okay. That's not Ooh, you got one of my favorite. I can't remember its name. It's like Eggy, Eggion, Helsley, Elgion. Elgion. Yeah. Can't remember his name ever, but he's dope. I yeah. like him. What? Ooh. Ooh, an Electros. This is actually a really good Electros card. It's like it allows it to play itself straight from the hand. Yeah. I know. I know, I know this because I have the um, English version of it. Yeah. Pretty overall solid card, and then uh, I don't know what heck this thing does. It's an Among Us though. <laughs> the heart and soul of the Among Us Pokemon memes. Are there Among Us Pokemon memes? Yes, it took over the Pokemon subreddit for like for a month. Ah, uh, see, I'm not on the Pokemon subreddit. And then for the uh, final pack of my half. The final pack that you get to take home. If you took the only two good cards, just like how you took home all the hand traps <laughs> in maximum gold, I'm going to be livid. <laughs> I'm going to suppress it, because I'm not that mean, but... I'm gonna be livid. Hey, I face. Hey, maybe, 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 maybe I didn't do a seance of the um, card gods today. Maybe. Executor. And then, hey, to finish off the final pack, we got a Caratosta. I'm glad that you know who that was, because I had no idea. Alright, we're gonna switch places here and uh, be back to you guys in two seconds. Alrighty, we are now switching the places. Why do those orange packs look like yellow on the camera? Do you see that? <laughs> you can sit in the, uh... Alright. Let's go, baby. Oh my goodness. You weren't kidding. <laughs> yeah, no, no, I was not. Alright, we got the Sword Dude, Jatini, Sloth Boy, Scraggy Evolution, and... Whatever this is. Braylon? Yeah, what you said. Next pack. <laughs> we got Baby Flygon. Even uh, though it's not even related to Flygon at all. <laughs> uh, oh! Who cares about that? I think we just pulled the money card. No, the Rainbow Rays have the money card, but... <laughs> but, like... That's going straight, in the sleeve, and it'll be double sleeve later. Oh, ho, ho, baby. Yeah, I think that was a heck of a pull right there. Alright, I won't complain. I won't complain. <laughs> Even one of those is perfect. That's actually the one card I was going for, because I love music. I mean, I mostly didn't have any expectations for the set, because all I know is like there's a Tyranitar on this set, and that's probably about the main thing. I'm like, oh yeah, that's cool. And a Lapras. The cool thing about Japanese cards is they are all either 9s or 10s. In the English version, they don't care. So they can be whatever when it comes to PSA. Teeny, uh, what's your baby? <laughs> Coil uh, Electric Boy. Oh, uh, that's Which Tapu Koko? Koko, that's right. Tapu Koko. I did not like those Pokemon. I was not a fan. Personally, I think uh, Sun and Moon and Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon get less credit than they deserve. Actually, they don't get they don't get enough credit. I think they're solid games overall. Focus. Onyx. Onyx is. Lizard Boy. Scorpion. <laughs> and Bat Boy. 
Honestly, Onyx, like, in the video games is absolutely terrible. Yeah. It has, like, 10, 10 base attack, and that's, like, it has no damage output. Man, a lot of Jutinis today. Jutini. You know, you know, if only, if only there's a Dragonite to go with the mix. Oh, Dragonite! Oh, that's funny. Speak the devil and he shall come. But that's a Also, haha, uh -huh, I find that funny. Same pack. Anyway, <laughs> that's getting the sleeves up. We're out of way, boys. And while we're at it, we're sleeping up this boy. Because we're here, you know. Epic Gamer Supreme. Next pack! We're not even halfway done. You've already pulled the two best GX cards. Adult Dratini, Sexy Cat. Uh, <laughs> By the way, it's lagging really bad. Is it still doing it? Oh, wait, I'm going to the cards. Is it still doing it? Yeah, it's good now. Yeah. That, we got Harry Boy. Just. We got Foil Manic. Yeah, just, you know, it's also way out of focus. Just letting you know. Yeah, I had a feeling. It's been going in and out of focus since I started doing it. Yeah. <laughs> it was, it's like... You know, these packs don't open easy whatsoever. Alright, we got Fish Boy. Another Sloth Boy. Teenage Boy. Doesn't this one evolve into Sexy Boy? No. No, that does not. Water Spider. I know no Pokemon names off the top of my head, except for, like, a couple. <laughs> you better know Charizard off the top of your head, or else you'll oh, be... Oh, I know Charizard. I'm not good. <laughs> I'm not that stupid. Alright, Blue Turtle. Scraggy. Uh, Chick. Lapras with rainbows. Ooh, that's pretty. Look at that. Honestly, though. Anyway. Adult Scraggy. We have both Scraggy and Adult Scraggy in this one. Ah. These are immediately going in the binder. They're not, like, gonna be played. <laughs> we got, uh, crap, what's it called? Teenage Sloth. Fossil. The annoying fish dudes that I run into all the time. Uh, that thing. That are trash. Is that a pager? Yeah, probably. Okay. And, uh, Fluffy Chick. You know what's really funny, though? Basculin is effective with the Magikarp of the Unova region, except the difference between it and Magikarp is... Magikarp is actually a half-decent encounter because Gyarados is, like, god-tier. Okay, here, wait. Riddle me this real quick. Uh, where is she? How does this go from white Fluffy to black Fluffy? Or brown Fluffy? Uh, good question. Where did the skin change come in? Because... Is going to reverse Michael Jackson? Yeah, something like that. Alright. Fishy boy. Oh, that is a dope artwork for him. I like that. Okay. So. I like that. Tauros, I think his name is. That would be correct. This chick. What is this? Is this Wait. The... Oh, that's Yveltal. Or yeah, Yveltal. The, the that's that's from X and game. Y. The new game? Yeah. Uh, X and Y, so, no, you know, that's... Gen 6. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then Jinx. Which, funny thing is, Gen 6 is ancient now, and it's funny. It doesn't feel like it came out that long ago, either. Like, yeah. seven years now? You know, I don't like Jinx. Yeah, nobody does. She reminds me of, <laughs> like, uh... Nicki Minaj? Yes, but also... What are those dudes that dress up like women? Drag queens? Drag queens, yeah. Nothing against drag queens, but that's what Jinx is. If you're, I guess if you're a drag queen, you like it. I like this artwork. He just looks so friendly, and then most of them is, like, angry. <laughs> Baby Mushroom. Beetle. Adult Scorpion. I want one of those Celebes in the pool bowl. Or a <laughs> uh, Sloth Boy. I feel like I feel, I feel, I feel, I feel, I feel like we've probably pulled most of the. I think we've pulled, if oh. not. I think we've probably pulled all of the um, GXs we might be getting in this. Um. Yeah. I love this dude. It's the, the adult version of the boy that I love. And Sexy Cat. <laughs> it's not Persian. <laughs> Have you seen what they've done to Persian? Oh, uh, yeah. I have. Alright, there's something foil in here. Alright. Execute. Ooh, it looks like that might be a full art. Eight boy. But Gee. I mean... Oh, Aerodactyl GX. Wah, wah, wah. And trainer. That's a full art. 
Aerodactyl GX, which I personally think I think I think in this case I like the. Uh, Wait, let's compare yours to mine. I think I think I personally like the um, base one a bit better artwork wise, honestly. Okay, mine is. You know I like yours better. Honestly. <laughs> it looks cooler. Yours yours is slightly more expensive though. It, yeah, it's like, I don't know why that artwork's not as cool. It's because, it's just, it's just because it's rarer. And, you know, full arts. It's not even a cool full art. Give me a Charizard full art. Okay. Alright, double sword. Baby bat. Fish. Foil. One of the dogs. Terrakion. Yeah, and then Koala. Cool. Alright, let's go over the poles. I think I actually overall got more foils than you. I believe you did, but I got. I think. Are there foils? Yeah. I don't know, I think there You got foil wifey, though, so. <laughs> hey, That's can... a cool artwork, I like that. Honestly, though. And boom. Alright, now we have special surprise. Special surprise. We're switching spots again. I feel like I warm up every seat and so that I feel bad when I have you sit down after me. <laughs> okay. I believe, I believe the parts just turns an invasion first. Does have special packs? Sure. I don't know. Alright, at the end of this one, we have a cool pack opening. Uh, just an extra little one pack. Enjoy. We have a TCG turns an invasion. Oh yeah, because Koala was the last one I pulled. Anyway. Alright. Time for the, uh, it's rolling, yeah? Yep. Yeah. <coughs> okay, we've got Crimson Invasion. This time it should open a whole heck of a lot of you here. As it bites me. <laughs> As it bites me. Yeah, don't try to call stuff like that, Nick, or else you'll end up looking like a fool. <laughs> so I guess it should open nice and easy because, you know, it's an American pack. Pumpkaboo. Snuffle. Is that a shiny that I see back there? Oh wait, no, that's the code guard. Do you play the online game? Yeah. Four guys. Do you use your code cards? <laughs> Never seen a counter energy before. That's interesting. Counter capture. Nice, nice. Alrighty guys, well that is everything for today's opening. Subscribe, hit the bell, so you know whenever we do our openings. We release them at, on the 8th of every single month. And we're, we need to go record another one <laughs> while we have time. So, I will see you all in the next one. Go check out the merch. Because by the time that you're seeing this, I don't know if you... Here, wait, let me, let me full screen this again. I don't know if you can see this stuff. The playmats down here at the bottom, the C, and then the blue thing. Those are this, or the, those are this month's two new playmats. The alt art in the original. And in fact, I can go show you what they look like right now. What the? No? Yeah, yeah. Anyway, yeah, so <laughs> go check those out. Anyway, I'm Anak from Anak Gaming, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye bye!